It's been a hot spot for nightlife in San Antonio for years, but now the St. Mary's Strip has become a big draw during the day. As Stephanie Sarter reports, the popular strip is growing, too, with more people wanting to move closer into the action. We come down here all the time. Jackie Lawson says they love coming down to St. Mary's Street on the weekend with the entire family. It's awesome. It's a really nice, like almost a family friendly time. We've been to um, a few other restaurants in the area and with the kids and um, we go to the zoo all the time too. It's just down the street. For years, the St. Mary's Strip had been a place most people associated as a place to party and drink. <laughs> and one that did not see a lot of traffic until maybe after 10 o'clock at night. That's really changed a lot in the last few years uh, as more restaurants have opened up. Peter opened up the cookhouse and Nola. Chris Kellum opened up at a girl. And you can definitely tell that St. Mary's Street has a steady flow of traffic during the day, especially on weekends. <laughs> Cheesement opened up just over a year ago and has been doing really well at brunch, happy hour, and at night. There are more food things happening where it's not just, okay, let's go down and rock and roll and take shots. And so that's cool. We're still very pro shots. I should clarify that. Having more restaurants down here is going to be great, and it's, it's cool to be a part of things kind of changing. Also changing the neighborhood around St. Mary's with homes being renovated and new homes being built. San Antonio is experiencing a wave where people are wanting to move close to the heart of the city. David Weekly recognized the vibrant culture and energy on St. Mary's. We've got oversized island. These new single family detached homes on St. Mary's just popped up last year and they are nearly sold out. It's been pretty incredible to watch the transformation and to build homes out of it and kind of watch the neighborhood grow and transform over time. It's it's kind of an honor to be a part of that. And realtors in this area say they don't see that growth slowing down anytime soon. Stephanie Serna, KSAT 12 News.